test, 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 test. Okay, good. Okay, good. All right, so here's All right, game. So here's the game. Top seven, playing top seven, seven minutes or less. Seven minutes or less. Uh, making a run right now to uh, ML Exchange, where I've set up a search. I've got some pretty cool criteria here. Um, looking for active listings, 100 to 250,000, 1,300 square feet, three bed, two bath, two car garage, uh, and uh, they have to be an REO bank owned. So. Um, uh, that's what we're going to do. We're going to go to a uh, uh, results and then I'll uh, do some filtering on these results to check some things out. What I'm looking at here, days on market, uh, and then the uh, comprehensive days on market, potentially could sort by that. I think one of the things we're going to look at here, which is a big driver, is the list price per square foot. And um, kind of see what's showing up. To the top 21 here and uh, <laughs> see what we get from a map view. Alright, map view. Let's see what these puppies look like. I did focus my search on the west side of town. Uh, first thing I can tell you is that we would stay away from properties that are right on. Um, well, I know a house kind of over in that area. One, two, forty-nine. Probably stay away from something that's right on the freeway. Here's uh, Forum Hills, one seventy-nine for a three-bed, probably two-bed, two-car garage. Austin Bluffs, possibly. Let's see what we got here. Winery Ridge, 145, three bed, two bath. Uh, that would probably be a pretty good pick. I'd, I would uh, select that one. Probably also it's going to run over 145 potentially. Swale at 249, uh, probably not. Probably skip this Aspen Leaf due to its proximity to there. Um, I need to look at number 12, Gibbs Hills, 237. Eh, looks like, uh, let me skip that. Gitano. Here's one, 235 on Playa Linda. Looks pretty good. Probably backs to Vista Run. You'd still probably have some traffic noise. Here we got Jamboree Mountain, 164 with a four bedroom, possibly. Take a look on that. Fennel Flower Court, I think those are kind of tightly in there, but this is a real nice area out here. And um, here's at the curve. Let's see here's Sahara Splendor Ridge for 234. It's a four bed. Could be nice. Little stream at 167. Jasmine Vine at 240. And another Jasmine Vine at 240. Um, Get it in. Kind of depends. All right. So uh, obviously, I have these sorted so that the ones that have the lower numbers are going to have a better price per square foot. So uh, eight has a good price per square foot. Uh, nine and ten have good price per square foot. Uh, Three and four are obviously showing up probably a factor because of being so close to the to the um, Summerlin Parkway. You know, still potentially could work. Seventeen, that's a little lower on there. Uh, let's see this six, Vitano Street, one sixty nine with a four bedroom. That'd probably be another pretty good pick. Uh, you are west of the Beltway. Um, you know, that'd be a good move. 
All right, I choose to know if that was seven minutes there. That was a quick run of what could be some uh, really good deals uh, in the Summerlin area. Uh, seven for seven, probably picked out about uh, three or four easy quick picks right there. Uh, let us know if you're interested. All right, bye.